I love you so much. What? What's up, guys? I got bored. Yes, I know I already wore the shirt. Uh, so let's talk about some future concept technology that I was looking up, and I thought they were really cool. They're just concepts for right now, but I want to share them with you guys because, hey, spring break is almost over. Nothing else to do. So coming up first is the Artifon Instrument 1. So this is supposed to be a hit with digital instruments. So this instrument is a single device. It's a, uh, being used to be able to mimic a different variety of instruments like a, let's uh, say, an organ or a guitar, anything like that, even even electronical instrument. It can hook up to any MDI-compatible software, and it can also be used for applications like GarageBand. So I can see this being a huge hit with um, instruments. So it's $349 for the Kickstarter, so it sounds like a pretty cool idea. So next is when you probably heard of Nike self-tying shoe. Uh, so this is influenced by the Back to the Future movie. So this is a still a work in progress concept, but uh, it's pretty much a self-tightened shoe uh, that is soon going to be a reality. And I'm really excited for these guys. I think they look really cool. It'd be really nice to see something like this. So the Ellen Musk Hyperloop is another really cool concept. It's a supersonic train, which is like you can travel at speeds up to 700 miles per hour. Uh, it's still in the concept phase and still being worked out, uh, but once it's all done, you can get to London and Edinburgh in under 30 minutes, which is pretty crazy. One of my favorites on this list, the Smart Rope. So an LED-enabled skipping rope syncs up to your smartphone. It can calculate the number of calories burned thanks to the sensor technology housed in the handles, which is pretty cool. And it actually does have a Kickstarter at 60 bucks. So next is the Life Hub. So this is another cool concept thanks to flexible OLED displays, Bluetooth earpieces, and other connectors. Life Hub can be shaped into a smartwatch, into a smartwatch or a smartphone, and even a headset, even a Bluetooth speaker or a projector. So the concept with this guy is that you don't need all separate devices uh, to be able to do something, which I think this guy is way ahead of his time. But I can see like this actually becoming true, and it would be pretty cool to see. Thanks for watching guys. Be sure to subscribe and leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.